William Gemai, Mathieu Van der Poel, Gemai to the line, Gemai still has it for the moment, has to keep it going, and Veni, Vidi, Bini, more history is made, Eritrea is the winner of the Grand Tour stage. Who is Biniam Germay? Biniam Germay from Eritrea was born in the year 2000, and he is now one of the up and coming stars of road cycling. The 22 year old proved his worth by winning both Ghent Vevelgem and a stage in the Giro after outsprinting none other than Mata van der Poel. His form looked strong in the Giro, and I would have expected him to claim a second stage victory if he had not been forced to abandon after shooting the cork of the champagne bottle into his eye while celebrating his win. Biniam Germay is now a star of the sport and a superstar in Eritrea. He signed a multi-million euro contract with world tour team Intermarché Wanti Gobba and now looks set to win some of the biggest events on the calendar. But how did he get to this point? Biniam Germay was born in the year 2000 in Asmara, Eritrea. At the age of 10, Germay preferred football, but his older brother, who was already into the sport, coerced him over to cycling and eventually into racing. Germay got noticed when he won both the Road and Time Troll Junior African Cycling Championships. He was then picked up by the World Cycling Centre, an institute to help cyclists from countries with less cycling infrastructure. This meant that in 2018, he moved to Switzerland to train and learn how to become a pro cyclist. This move gave him the opportunity to race the biggest junior races in Europe and progress as a rider. He performed well and two years later, he got his first pro contract. His professional career started in 2020 when Germay signed for five years with the team Delco Provence. However, the team folded midway through 2021 due to financial difficulties caused by the COVID pandemic. He was then snapped up by Belgian team Intermarché Wanty Gobert, where he instantly started picking up results in smaller races. But 2020 was his real breakout year. He consistently picked up strong results at a number of big races, including a top 15 at Milan San Remo. Then came his biggest win. Binan Gamay claimed victory against Vevelgem at the age of 21. This victory elevated Germay to new heights. His salary was tripled and his contract was extended to 2026. His Ghent Vevelgem victory also meant he became the first African cyclist to win this race in its 90 year history. The race also proved his versatility as a rider and his ability to stay calm and tactical during the most intense moments. But Germay was not done there. In the Giro, Germay claimed six top fives, showing his incredible consistency. This is made even more impressive considering he abandoned after stage 10, meaning he finished in the top five of more than half of the stages he rode. On stage 10, Germay masterfully won from a reduced group, outsprinting the likes of MVDP. This victory made Germay the first black rider to win a stage at a Grand Tour. Then somehow, while celebrating his win on the podium, Germay managed to pop the Prosecco cork into his eye. The injury forced him to abandon the race, which is a shame considering his amazing form. Germay didn't take any more victories in 2022, however he had a decent rest of the season, achieving a number of top 10s. Germay is a versatile rider who can endure long and hard stages, gets over short climbs and has a strong sprint. His ability seems similar to Massa van der Poel, an explosive rider who can endure tough stages. This kind of skill set lends itself perfectly to the classics, and I will not be surprised if Bernam Germay is able to win a monument, or maybe even multiple in his career. The World Championships is also a race that he could win. The 2025 World Championships will be held in Rwanda, and it would be amazing to see the biggest African cycling star competing the top of his game there. The limit for Germay may only be the really high mountains and time trials, but other than that the potential seems unlimited. Comment down below, what do you think he is capable of?
like the video if you enjoyed and subscribed if you want to see more cycling content.